Okay, for this uh, tutorial, it's going to be based around Photoshop and how to change iColor. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave a link to this actual photo if you want to use it to practice with this and follow along with this tutorial. <coughs> so, what we're going to do is um, in the layers palette, I'm going to click on the layer. And then we're going to make, you know, click on OK to make it so it's not background and lock the layer. Then we're going to drag this to the new layer icon, which will copy it. And then we're going to click Control, Shift, and U, which will turn it to, you know, black and white desaturated. From there what we need to do is we need to click on the pen tool. Most people use the lasso tool. I don't tend to use that. So what we're going to do is we're going to just click around the edges of uh, the eye that we want to change with the pen tool. Don't worry about being too sloppy, we'll correct that. Now what we're going to do is we're going to right click in this area and make selection. We're just going to leave the settings as they are. Click OK. Now what we're going to do is make a new layer. Then we're going to fill it with a color of our choice. I'm going to use blue for this. So yeah, click on one of those two to bring up the color picker. Select your color. Now just click uh, Alt and Backspace, and that will fill it. So what you can do is press Control and D to select it. And now we'll use we'll get the filter blur, Gaussian blur. That should be okay. You see why I said it doesn't really matter if you're uh, sloppy or not as accurate this step before this. So we click on OK. Now where it says layer, what we're going to do is we're going to open this and we're going to click on overlay. And you'll see it's instantly changed it. But there's still blue bits around it, so we'll need to tidy that up a little bit. Just get an eraser and do it to a diameter of around 25. Now we can close that. And we can just start erasing away a little bit. Make sure the opacity of it is around, probably around 50%. So if you mess up, it's not going to be that noticeable. Now, you've changed the color, so you want to make it so that your fur that you've done the same. So here's what you're going to do. You're going to take the pen tool again. Uh, make selection. Click on OK. Then you want to press um, Control Shift and I. Which one invert it? You want to make sure that your black and white layer is selected. Press the delete button, then press uh, Control and D. Get the eraser tool again. So, delete. 
And that's the end of that tutorial. So, um, hope you find that useful. Until next time, thanks for watching, goodbye.